And the bots are off. All three Red Alliance bots make it off their half as 26.82 and 37.37. Score into the Red Alliance cargo bay. 51.90 tries to scare a hatch pin onto the Blue Alliance cargo bay, but the sandstorm clears and the cargo spills out across the field. We've got 32.25 securing some more cargo into the Red Alliance cargo bay as 55.18 moves across the field with the hatch panel. We've got 32.25 adding more cargo to the cargo bay, but 4.35 pushes it out of the way and the cargo bounces off. 55.18 secures the hatch panel to the Red Alliance cargo ship. On the Blue Alliance side, 51.90 adds cargo to the cargo bay, immediately followed by 57.62. Thirty-two twenty-nine just races across the field to find some more cargo. Twenty-six eighty-two heads to the Red Alliance cargo ship. Fifty-one ninety adds a hatch gun with the Blue Alliance cargo ship. Thirty-two twenty-nine adds more cargo to the Red Alliance cargo bay. Fifty-one ninety at the Blue Alliance. Loading station trying to secure a hatch panel. And it looks like it's almost got it. 3229 has a hatch panel headed towards the Red Alliance cargo ship. 5762 has a piece of cargo. Looks like it's headed towards the Blue Alliance cargo bed. 2682 races back across the field. Looks like it's headed towards the HAB with 30 seconds left in the match. 10 game begins with 20 seconds left as robots race to the HAB. 435 safely parks on the Blue Alliance side. 2682 safely parked on the Red Alliance side. 3229 also made it to their Alliance's HAB. 435 and 5762 trying to spin on to level one. A little complicated, all tied up, no more love, and I'd hate to see you waiting. Have have and the scores are in. The Red Alliance takes victory with two ranking points.